what's going on? What's going on? Good morning, y'all. Good afternoon. You know what I mean? Wherever you at. Good evening. But uh, as you can see, I'm back with another one. I had to tape it up. I just tore the box open. I was going to do an unboxing, but I'm still doing an unboxing. I haven't been in a box yet. <clears throat> I realized I still had my addresses and everything showing, so I had to redo the whole thing. But here, short story. Let's get down to business. This right here is a... a uh, etches product um this right here is a double den setup uh for the caprice now i thought this was pretty cool i saw a couple of people do these so i figured i'd check it out and i grab it so i got this a couple days ago it came in uh it shipped within a week i say uh of me purchasing so the shipping was good as you can see the boxing is nice you know what I mean? So pretty good. Now, my dilemma is <clears throat> I'm not sure if I want to wait. I have a Caprice. As you know, I showed you all the Caprice, but I'm not sure. I see the Impalas are coming down. i seen a couple of Impalas on Facebook Marketplace, but it seems to me like a lot of Impalas have been dogged out. You know what I mean? Like they really, really messed up. Um, And my Caprice is clean, you know? So... I'm trying to bait. Do I want to wait and spend the money on just getting a pile or do I want to just go ahead and forward the Caprice? Other than the two rust spots on it, the Caprice is um, great. Um, drives, runs well and everything. Um, and I'm planning on taking the motor out anyway. So that's neither here. That's my dilemma. As y'all know, I got the shocks already sitting in a, in a box. But this right here is, like I said, is a, um, a product used for a double den. Um, turn a caprice into a double den, as you know, it's a single den. And um, I'm going to open it up. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. Okay. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. As you can see, definitely box nicely. Nice padding in it. You know what I mean? Let's take this out real quick. Man, I'll tell you, man. They kill you with the boxes, bro. You be thinking it's huge. You know what I mean? They got these big behind boxes. But it's not just dumb, man. Because I get packages from Amazon. I might order one part or one wire and it come in this huge box. But, um... Well, you know what? This is relevant because they got the, the plate down there, as you can see. So, this is what it looked like uh, in the box. This is what it looks like. And as you can see, they... Okay, okay, Impala. You know what I mean? Got a little Impala sticker. That's clean. That's nice. I like that. That's good quality. I'm going to stick that up somewhere. That's nice. Mm -hmm. That's just... That's just... Comes with another box, and that's probably the nuts, bolts, and goodies. Okay. Let's get this out of here. Let's get this out. Let's clean this up so y'all can see. All right. So let's put this nice and neat so y'all can see. This is what you get in the box. All right. You look like you got your manual, video instructions they give you. You know what I mean? That's nice. That's nice. And then you have the bracket itself, which is very nice, very clean, packaged, very nice. That's it, that's in the box. All right, let's put that down real quick. Let's set this up so you can see exactly what's in the, uh, I'm scraping up my table. I don't know. Um, I'm going to be getting a new table soon anyway. I ain't even going to get on a rant about these tables, these, these furnitures. They don't build furniture like they used to. Um, so there you have it. Uh, you have the mountain plate. Again, this turns into a double den. Um, I've seen a couple of people do it on YouTube, but it seems like it's fairly straightforward, but you know how that go. It seems like it, but it takes you five, six hours later, 24 hours later. The double den will be up here. Your air box, your air units will be up here, as you can see. Okay. Oh, and they sent a little picture of how it's going to look. As you can see, this is how it's going to look. Let me let me get up close on there. 
That's exactly how it's going to look. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. All right. All right. All right. They give you some instructions. Show you how to do it. I'm not sure if y'all picking that up. Well, they show you how to do it. That's pretty good. They give you pictures and it's also a video instruction on um on YouTube. They also got a video instructions on YouTube, which is clean. Um. I thought that was pretty cool. And like I said, that's how it's going to look. So, I thought this was pretty cool. I thought it was pretty clean. Uh, and I believe this is the bezel. This should be a bezel. That's the reason why it's wrapped up, see? That's the that's the bezel. So, that's what it's going to look like with the bezel. Let's keep that nice and clean. Um, I remember a guy saying the texture side is the side that goes in. In like this and this side is the side that sticks out um, but one guy was saying you can get some texture paint and make it almost look like that make it look real clean so it's gonna come you know what I mean now this is gonna be a summer project again this won't be a summer project I'm gonna get into and again like I said I'm still trying to figure out what I want to do let's open up this box real quick let's see what we got in here let's see what we got in here Okay, okay. All right, okay. Let's see what we got. We got the bracket plates. These go on the... Um, these go on the radio itself, the double den radio. Now, I haven't got my double den yet. You know, like I said, I've just been buying parts. You know, some here, down here. Um, this is fairly a budget build. I'm not putting a crazy sound system in there. But um, I just want it to look clean. This is the epoxy, five-minute epoxy. As you can see, that's cool, man. It's cool that they give you everything that you need. Um, this again is the double dim mount, the the frame. This is the put inside the the dash itself, and make sure that it's clipped in. Okay, and these are the screws. Now, like I said, it's a um, it's a couple different videos on this uh, putting it in. There's a couple different videos on this, putting it in and setting it up. Um, they got this one guy. They, the company actually uh, shows you how to put it in, too. Uh, this one guy I follow on YouTube, um, OTG Mechanic, I believe it is. Something like that. Uh, real, real thorough dude. Um, he, um, he also does it. It seems like he works on all Impalas and maybe Caprices too. But uh, he does it too, man. Very, very knowledgeable. Uh, I looked at a couple of his videos also. But, you know, I just want to keep it short. Let y'all see exactly what come in the etches. Um, the etches double den uh, install, whatever, equipment. This is what comes in. It is a very nice product so far. What I'm looking at and I'm hoping is a relatively easy install, but we shall see. Again, I'm just piling parts. So I just wanted to get y'all, let y'all know where I was at. And uh, I keep coming to y'all when I keep stacking these parts up. And then I'm going to just do everything all at once. You know what I mean? Just have it psh, knock everything out at once. So therefore you have, there, there you have it. Uh, one more thing. Uh, I'm, tr I'm I'm thinking about doing the LS swap in it, man. I'm thinking about doing the LS swap in it. Uh, but we shall see. The the prices of these LS motors, man, have gone through the roof. And I mean, and they don't even have little mi uh miles on it. They have gone through the roof. So, you know. I might it might just be cheaper for me just to buy a whole vehicle and I was looking into it might just be cheaper to buy me a whole vehicle and just use it as a donor because the prices on these, these just the motors alone you could just go to an auction and just buy the motor itself buy the whole vehicle and just break down the vehicle but that's neither here nor there I ain't gonna talk your heads off that's a little something light for the day um definitely cut I definitely uh fill y'all in when I put it in get it in but definitely a good product man they definitely send you with everything that you need to get this uh set up you know what i mean just stacking parts baby just stacking parts 
Y'all be good. Be safe out there because it's getting wild. And I holler at y'all later. Wow.